Welcome back to the lab, boys and girls. Today, I want to discuss something that I was thinking about heavily over the course of this past weekend since Siege has had its free weekend out and it's been heavily discounted on the PlayStation Store. So there's been a lot of noobs playing. It got me to thinking, is Siege really that beginner friendly? Is it easy to just jump into for somebody right now in the current state of the game and start playing and expect to improve their skills and get good? Yeah, I think so. I really do think so. You know, I wasn't a noob that long ago. I started playing around, gosh, what was it? Uh, Operation Parabellum with Maestro and Alibi. So by no means have I been playing for a very long time. There are people that have been playing for literally years before I have. But I really hit the ground running. When I first started playing, I was hooked immediately. I was coming from, like many other people that get into Siege for the first time, other first-person shooters such as Call of Duty or Battlefield, and for me there was really no going back. Those games are checkers and this game is chess. You'll hear that all the time from people who try to explain the difference between the two. Call of Duty slash Battlefield slash those type of games and Rainbow Six Siege. There was a bit of a learning curve for me getting into this game, definitely. 50% of it, I would say, is learning the maps, the operators, the gadgets, but it's not only that. The gunplay is so much different than any other game as well. Holding tight angles is more important than any other game I've played. Learning when to peek, learning how to peek, learning how to position, using your allies. It's all very overwhelming at first for a beginner, for a noob, absolutely. But once you get the hang of it, and it took me maybe about... Hmm, a solid month I'd say, maybe two months, maybe I'm giving myself too much credit, before I really got the hang of it. Now everybody's going to be different of course, and I was fortunate enough to play with other very experienced Siege players who have been playing the game much longer than I have. And I think that's the key when you're getting a noob into the game. Bring them along with you. Bring them with other experienced players. Sometimes the best thing that a noob can do is just fail. Throw shit at the wall, see what sticks die. You have to die. It's part of the learning process. And while they're dead, they can get on cams, learn how to do callouts, they can spectate their other teammates who are much better at the game than them and learn how to do by watching them. That's how I learned how to play. You learn maps very well that way. Especially when you're a beginner, you tend to anchor heavily. Stay on, you know, hold one line of sight the whole game. And when you spectate and you're on cameras, you can really learn the map a lot better that way. Map knowledge is key, like I mentioned earlier. I wouldn't say this game is not noob friendly. You know, as toxic as this community is, and it is very toxic, anyone who's played this game for any amount of time can vouch for that. One thing we all share in common with each other is a love for this game. And we want to see it succeed, we want to see it do well. So when we see noobs, and I can only speak from my personal experience of course, but when I see a noob, I am generally more lenient towards them. I want to help them, I want to give them advice, and most people that I've seen with noobs in game lobbies are the same way. We want them to do well, we want them to keep coming back because we want to see the game that we love grow and continue to play. So no, I do not believe that Siege is not beginner friendly. If anything, it needs these noobs now more than ever before. So bring your new friends in, noobs don't feel shy, get in there, die someone's got something negative to say about you fuck them you're learning we were all noobs once thanks for watching guys i'll catch you next time on the lab that was such a good and then you fucking killed that other dude through